So, a day before my flight, nagayos na ako ng mga gamit ko. And sinama ko na rin nga pala itong pamangkin ko na sobrang kulit. Charot! <laughs> So this is me at the airport na nagmamadaling pumunta sa departure area dahil late na ako sa flight ko. At finally, nandito na nga ako sa loob ng airport at kailangan ko nalang hanapin ang airline ko. So after check-in, diretso ako agad sa immigration. So after a few minutes of interview from the immigration officer, I finally passed! I can't wait to see Sejong in Thailand. After ma-check ng mga luggages ko, I ran as fast as I could dahil napakalayo ng gate 1 and it's almost time na rin naman. So finally, nakarating din ako sa boarding area ng gate 1. At wala pa akong 5 minutes sa upuan ko ay nag-open na ang gate. So this is me na sobrang haggard na. Pero nakuha ko pa rin mag-vlog. <laughs> to be honest, Sobrang mixed emotions nang nafe-feel ko while papasok ako sa loob ng aeroplano kasi it's my first time traveling alone and outside the country pa. Independent girl yarn! <laughs> so shout out to these two Chinese people in front of me that I met earlier at the airport because they helped me during check-in. I didn't have a chance to ask their names so I just want to say hi to you guys. Enjoy Bangkok too! And now I'm inside the plane and I'll see you Thailand in 3 hours! Sawadi Thailand! Sobrang gutom na ako guys. Hindi pa ako nagla-lunch and dinner. And it's already 9pm. So ayan, tamang tingin-tingin lang sa paligid habang hinahanap ang exit area. Papuntang immigration. Upon my arrival in Thailand, the first thing that I did is I bought a SIM, exchange money, and grab dinner. So after ko kumain, duman kami ng friend ko sa convenience store na to and we bought some snacks. Mahirap na magutom, guys. <laughs> After we bought all the things that we need, we headed to our hotel. Sobrang smooth lang ng biyahe namin, like walang traffic or anything. My Thai friend told me na grabe ang traffic dito sa Thailand. But I haven't experienced it yet. So let's see tomorrow. First day here in Thailand! My friend and I woke up at 7 a.m. and we grabbed some breakfast here in Foodland. So, ito yung menu nila, and I've ordered fried pork with chili and basil leaves served with rice. My Thai friend recommended it, so din ko na rin. But since hindi ko kayang itolerate yung sobrang anghang, I told her to make it less spicy. And the mukbang begins. Charot. <laughs> so, ayan guys. Tamang kain lang ako. I don't know how to describe this food, but to be honest, masarap siya. So, sa mga mahihilig dyan sa spicy foods, I recommend you to try this one when you go to Thailand. So, pagkatapos namin kumain, we headed to Bangkok Arts and Culture Center Museum. So far, hindi naman ganun ka-traffic and hindi rin masyadong mainit. And we're here!
those who are fan of arts like me, I recommend you to visit here when you go to Thailand. It's a nine-story building and sobrang daming arts and sculptures na makikita. So after namin mag stroll around the museum, we also went here in Siam Paragon. This place is actually a mall. So we went inside and dito na kami naghanap ng pwede namin kainin for lunch. So I ordered this vegetarian food na hindi ko alam kung anong pangalan pero masarap siya. And I also ordered watermelon shake. After namin kumain, bumili na rin ako ng mga konting pasalubong. After strolling around the city, it's time to watch Kim Sejong's first fan meeting here in Bangkok. So this is during the rehearsal part and sobrang ganda niya, I swear. So after the rehearsal, me and my friend went outside to grab some dinner first since ang start ng fan meeting is around 6 p.m. So I just ordered some noodles for my dinner kasi busog pa ako. So that's how my first day here in Bangkok ended. See you on the next episode!